until one realizes that he is living inside his human mind. Human body functions like a camera with five senses eyes, nose, ears, mouth, and the body. The moment one sees, smells, hears, tastes, and feels, he takes pictures, and those pictures are automatically stored in his brain. One thinks, speaks, and acts according to what he has stored in his mind, no more and no less. This is how the human mind is created, and it is the false mind. In the universe, only the true mind has existed from the beginning. However, humans have created the false minds for themselves, which caused all the suffering. So, the basic principle of this meditation is discarding the false mind and finding the true mind. People come to this meditation with various reasons of their own and learn how to discard them. At first, students are surprised by the fact that their mind are actually being discarded and are eager to discard some more to get rid of the problems they have. People enjoy discarding because they become calmer, have more accepting minds and thus have less conflict with others and can understand the true meaning of the Bible or other scriptures as their consciousness expands. But at the same time, some feel frustrated from the seemingly never-ending process of discarding and ask, when do all the false minds disappear completely? This is the time for them to take their meditation to the next level, to enlighten truth. Once again, people live taking pictures from the moment they are born and not a single moment goes by without taking pictures. People are living inside their own minds, which are false. This means that even when people meditate, they meditate from inside their false minds. The reason why it takes time for people to realize this is because they are blinded by the desire to resolve the problem that led them to the meditation in the first place. It is only after those minds are discarded to a certain extent that people can finally realize the true essence of this meditation from their hearts, that one lives in his false mind world that he has created. It is only then that people begin to meditate without expectation, because they finally understand that the reason why we need to meditate goes well beyond resolving some personal issues. It is to not live inside our false minds. Those who come to realize this truth won't follow their false mind anymore. When one is overwhelmed by a certain emotion, he will be aware that he is feeling it from inside his false mind and discard. When he judges someone, he will be aware that he is making the judgment from inside his false mind and discard. When he wants something, he will be aware that he is wanting it from inside his false mind and discard. Consequently, all the problems can be resolved when one truly realizes that humans are living inside their own false minds that they created. However, this realization can only come from the clean mind after one has discarded enough false minds. When one realizes that he thinks false thoughts, dreams false dreams, and does false deeds in his false mind, it will help him to stop doing many things. It will help him to stop living as a slave to his false mind and start living as the owner of his life.